about that and um, I've got the <laughs> fingers crossed. <laughs> there we go, that's good. There we are. <laughs> and then we just need to do your house. <laughs> yeah. so that was your journey to work, basically. Yeah. 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 <laughs> and what year was that? I started here in 1962. Walking the dog, lead drawn, always autumn past hooded goats on Roman Ridge, to the sodium glare of old man's elbow, in regulated spots of artificial light, always a soundtrack of Peel and Kellner. Near to Lantern Julie's, first Chinese in town, they threw the firework. I told them off. Telephone wires above, always 1978. I went to see my auntie Ruth, who recently had a damaged roof. The wind it howled and blew quite strong until the chimney fell along the rooftop high and down the chimney into the fire. Back to back houses then, no fridge or freezer or washing machine, a toilet shared with the back to back geezer. To the wash house she would go, with the other women to share you know, chatter and chatter while washing was done, all quite sociable and fun. But all the weight when all was ready to carry home in a basket heavy, down the entry to hang in the yard with privies aplenty and washing lines shared by many. Shopping was done on Port Mahon, everything handy, butchers, bakers, grocers and greens, library and Oxford picture palace near on, slipper baths to keep yourself clean, swimming pool as well you'll see. What more could you want, everything so near and ready to share? No car needed and everyone friendly, plus neighbours who care. Sad to say, most of it gone, people have changed and moved along. Have today's planners got it all wrong, with the supermarket so strong. I'm used to doing that with other people. Well, you know, again, I love getting the photographs together and things like that from my family. Mm. But I've not really done it in my life. Mm -hmm. This is a great opportunity to do that. Mm. You know, on the, on the Friday afternoon, working for a couple of hours, mm. um, being creative and, and digging a bit deeper mm. into, into memories and, and then expressing them uh, in a way that I've, you know, I've not probably not done stuff like that since my teens. I've well, had a brilliant. fantastic day. Yeah. I've met people who I've not seen for 60 years. Yeah. A friend came and he said, are you Barbara? Who used to be Barbara Eden? And I said, yeah. He said, yeah. I'm Terry Rays. Our mothers used to be best friends. And we used to go to one another's houses when we were children. I've got photos of them at school in many trips and I've not seen him for 60 years. And he's turned up today because his mum was on one of these photos I sent at Star. Wow. It came about from that walk we did up to Park with Springs. Good to walk with others. Um, yeah, I like, I like exploring, I do a lot of exploring. When I walk, mm. uh, just kind of put that into context. Um, discuss it with other people. Yeah. It was good to be alongside other people with a lot of stories from, you know, personal history. I think it's quite interesting because I've been brought up in the area and seen Park and Hall, Park Woodside for years. Never ever went up there until that day that we ventured up with the group. It's brought out loads of things. I've had my photos published in paper that were all due to going up Parkwood Springs. So it's been really rewarding for me.
You know, I've not done any art since I was at school or anything like that. Yeah, yeah. 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 It's been nice to dip into those. You get uh, books about Hillsborough, Walkley, Crooks, but nobody mentions uh, ABC Street, so a deep send area. Mm. You never get some mention at all. Oh, I'm really glad that, like, you know, that, uh, as soon as I saw it, I was uh, right glad that, that I could come down and have a look. And uh, some of the things this lady's got here, you know, it's brilliant. Mm. Yeah. That, that's my fifth birthday, that's 1940, 1948, that one. Oh, what a lovely kid you look. Go on, let me know, you'll enjoy them, you'll find something you weren't expecting and, and really interesting people. I'd definitely say go on, go on with this. So, has it been worthwhile for you? <gasps> well, it's been superb. <laughs> I've had a wonderful time. Oh, yeah.